Hello everyone. Today we will be discussing again chapter number 1 class 6 science food where does it come from lecture number 2. In this video we will be covering few topics. They are sources of food, food ingredients we get from plants and food ingredients we get from animals. Now let us learn about some sources of food. We get food mainly from two sources either from plants or animals. Let us first of all learn about parts of plants which act as a source of food. You all know a plant has different parts like flower, stem, roots, leaves and fruit which you can clearly see from the diagram. Now we'll learn about edible and non-edible parts of a plant. Edible parts. The eatable parts of a plant are called edible parts. On similar ground, non-edible parts, they are the parts which humans do not eat. For example, in a mango plant, mango, that is the fruit, is the only edible part. Remaining parts like stem, root and its leaves are non-edible parts for humans. Some of you may wonder, do all plants have just one edible part? Obviously, no. Some plants have more than one edible parts which can be eaten as food. Like, in a mustard plant, the edible parts are its leaves and seeds which are used to extract oil that is used in cooking. You can read it out the information here. Here we have table number one in which we have listed down different parts of a plant which we eat and the examples of the plant the first part is stem we have a general notion that stem is the part which is present above the ground however we have some underground modified stems like onion potatoes garlic ginger turmeric Second part is root. Underground modified roots are used to store food in these plants which we eat. For example, carrot, radish, turnip, sweet potato and beetroot. The third part is leaf. Green leafy vegetables are rich source of iron and are commonly available during winter months. For example, spinach, mint, coriander, cabbage, fenugreek which is commonly known as methi. The fourth part is flour. Some commonly consumable flours are cauliflower, broccoli, rose, banana flour and papaya flour. The next part is fruit. The common fruits like apple, mango, grapes, orange, watermelon are known to all of us. However, do you know some of the vegetables like tomato, chili, cucumber, brinjal, pumpkin, they are actually the fruit of the respective plant which we consume as vegetables. 
The next part is seed. We have different different types of seed based upon their role. The first type is oil seeds. We can extract oil from these seeds and it is used in cooking. Soya bean, mustard, groundnut. The next category is cereals. We are aware wheat, rice, maize are the commonly used cereals at our home. Last category is pulses. Gram, green gram, black gram are the pulses. Now let us learn about animal products which are the sources of food for us. We get different food item from animals. They are number one milk, number two eggs, number three honey, number four meat. Now let us look at the different source of food that is animal. Animal products as a source of food. In this table we will be learning about few animal products like milk, egg, honey, meat or flesh. You all know these are the products which we get from animals. Now let us look at the examples of animals which provide us these items. Milk. We get milk from cow, buffalo, goat, sheep, camel. Number two, eggs. We get eggs from hen, duck, ostrich, goose. The third product is honey. We get honey from bees. Bees collect the nectar from the flowers and store it in their beehives. The fourth product is meat or flesh. The flesh of goat, pig is eaten, is eaten in the form of mutton. If I talk about hen and chicken, it is eaten in the form of chicken. Some of the seafood we get from crab and fish. At the end of lecture 2, I have got few questions for you as homework. Initial set of questions are of multiple choice type. In these questions, you have to choose the most appropriate option as per the question. Question number 1. Honey bees make honey from Option A. Pollen grains Option B. Petals Option C. Nectar Option D. Bud Question number 2. The part of a banana plant which is not used as food is Option A. Flower Option B. Fruit Option C. Stem Option D. Root Question number 3 Given below is a list of edible plants. Option 1. Banana Option 2. Pumpkin Option 3. Lady's finger Option 4. Brinjal Which pair of plants have two or more edible parts? Option A. 1 and 2 Option B. 2 and 3 Option C, 3 and 4 and Option D, 1 and 4. Question number 4. State the part in the following 
that we eat. A. Sugarcane plant B. Bitter guard plant Question number 5 What are dairy products? Give examples. Examples <laughs> 